and tell us if you see a state championship or even a regional championship, we'd all shake our heads. Look around, there's no banners, and like, where would you guys like to be? How do you want to be remembered? Like, we had all these goals. Of course we had goals, but never like what we have now. Lady Hornet hoops is on the rise. A year after picking up their first playoff win since 2017, Erie County is 23-2, and two, off to a perfect start in district and 12th in the state. We've had talent for a long time, and I feel like the bond that we've created on and off the court has just, I mean, that's just built us up even more. You can have our subs in, and I feel just as comfortable as with them as our starting five. These girls are some of the most competitive people I've ever met, and knowing that and knowing how much they want this, I think really sets us apart, too, for our drive and determination. On a team made up of several underclassmen, junior Aubrey Tillman says having a senior leader like point guard Kagan James has given the team a big advantage. She's great to have. She can always, like, run the show and uh, kind of get us to where we need to be. And I don't think a lot of teams have that uh, that figure, that leader that uh, we need. Another major figure is head coach Jacob Connor, who is entering his 10th season with the program. Coach Connor really tells us and reminds us, like, are you satisfied with where you are right now? We have a motto that's called Next. So if Coach Connor's ever, oh, whoa, 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 and we're like, Next, Coach, and he's like, okay, that makes, lets him know that we got it, and we just, we can go into the next one. This season could end up being one for the history books. The Lady Hornets are only seven wins away from tying a school record, looking to be the first to ever make it to a regional final, and even further, the state tournament. And it's just really neat to understand that we are there. Like we are those girls that people look out for and we are we could make history for our school. And at the end of the day, you know, whatever happens tomorrow and the rest of the season, I'm really proud of everyone and where we've come. I'm really grateful that I get to be at this on this team and with these girls, they're like my sisters and I just love all of them and I'm really excited for this year. Stay up.